Okay, Lewis, you can stay, but if you ever threaten me again, you will regret it. Okay, since this does not count as a threat, I want to be named a partner in the firm. That's just not going to happen, because you tried using Mike to blackmail me, and you forged documents for the SEC. I refuse to tarnish the name of this firm. I would think about the repercussions of your actions, Jessica. It might be better for the well-being of the firm if you cooperate with me. Well, Lewis, if I were you, I would think about the repercussions of your actions. I'm not sure that an attempt at coercion was the best idea. As a top manager, this is a serious decision. What you reading? I'm in a bit of a predicament currently, so I'm just trying to figure out how to deal with it appropriately as the head of management. Find anything useful? I think it'll be useful to use the utilitarian approach on this one. I have a lot on the line, and there will be a consequence either way. I just have to move past my ego and focus on what's right for the firm and all of you guys. I know you don't want to hear this right now, but Lewis really does love the firm and only blackmailed you because he thought it was only his only option at this point. And if you don't mind me saying, it kind of worked. This firm is his life and I know he would give his all as a senior partner. Thanks for your input, Donna. I will take this into consideration.